The Nomad Bridge just got hacked for over $150 million. I'm going to explain to you how this happened and why you need to be extremely careful when dealing with bridges. The problem with cryptocurrency bridges is that the entire balance sits on the bridge wallet. If there's a mistake in the code, the entire bridge value is at risk. If the team behind the bridge gets compromised, the entire value in the bridge is at risk. This is because when you move money onto a bridge, what happens is you send your money over to the bridge contract. The bridge contract then holds that balance and writes you an IOU on the new network that you're sending your money to. So essentially they hold the backed value and you have an IOU sheet that is backed by that bridge contract value. As we've seen many times now, if the bridge value gets compromised in any way, what happens is you hold now an IOU sheet that is entirely worthless. There is no back balance. Now it might show in your account that you have a balance, but the reality is you had an IOU that is now worthless. This is essentially a not your keys, not your crypto scenario. The value of these assets are being held on the main chain and the side chain you're sending it over to is just giving you an IOU slip. You don't actually hold the value on that side chain. Now credit where credit is due. This tweet thread that was put together is really great in explaining what happened here and this person actually looked into the technical side of how this was possible now first this person thought they were seeing a bug they saw a send 0.01 wrap btc get back 100 wrap btc essentially a money printer scenario that just doesn't make sense after they investigated and looked into it they did in fact conclude that they people were sending 0.01 and receiving 100 back what else is really interesting is that the bridge contract went straight to processing instead of proving a transaction first. Now they get into some technical details here, but the gist of it is that essentially the contract should have had a system that would have double checked and ensured that transaction was proven before processing it. This should have raised a red flag and stopped any fraudulent transactions from being processed. Now they ended up testing this here to see if it would accept something that should be deemed as invalid. However, as you can see by the screenshot, it did return a true value. Now it appears that when the team was doing an update, they accidentally approved it so that the 0x00 would actually be able to be processed when normally this should not happen. Now they do point out that in development, this is a common practice. However, this going through on the public code had the unfortunate side effect of now allowing anybody to just prove a transaction. They get into a point here that I think is really important. This hack ended up being so chaotic because you didn't need to have the technical skills to be able to actually hack in to see what was going on here. Essentially, you could just push through fraudulent transactions without having a ton of knowledge or experience when it comes to Solidity or other programming software. This small mistake unfortunately led to over $150 million and some estimates somewhere in the neighborhood of $190 million that was stolen from the bridge. This is why you need to be extremely careful when you start using bridge contracts, exchanges, whatever it may be, where your wallet that you control doesn't actually hold the true value of the tokens that you're talking about. You're not a mainnet holding ETH with the token value. You're going off on something else and you're starting to trust other people. It seems like an honest mistake that happened here, but this again is why you need to be very careful as you go through your crypto journey. If you want help knowing about some technical things within cryptocurrency and you want help knowing about some red flags that you should definitely avoid, be sure to subscribe to my channel. I help give you some of that necessary information 